Hello, so good afternoon po. So today is November 14, 2022. Yeah, 2022. Okay, so kumusta? Meron tayo dito ng i-repair. Uh, this is no display. Okay, napa-disassemble ko na ito kay Ison. So, we need to check. What is that? Nangangamoy sunog ah. Sunog ka yan. Hindi ko alam, sa kapit-bahay. So, ito yung ating re-repair. So, medyo marumi siya. Ayan. So, this, uh, check natin. Speci uh, physical inspection natin siya. Kung may makikita tayong problem. Bago natin siya testin. Okay. Dahil matapil lang siya. Uh, so, hindi ko muna siya lilinisin para yung ating ebidensya Kung ano yung nag-faulty niya or any damage. So, makita ko siya. Okay, makita agad natin. Baka kasi mapitik. Kahit yung, minsan kasi, yung uh, tawag dito, yung lalo na yung mga uh, factory plugs, yung lumabas siya, at least nasa side siya, sa tabi niya, uh, makikita natin kung may problem yun. yun especially dito sa mga IC, na mga nakadikit. Yun. Kaya hindi ko siya masya nililinis agad kapag kung, kung mayroon siyang talagang problem. Ayan, para makita natin yung evidence, no? Mas maganda kasi yun. It's come to repairing. Mas perfect kasi yun. May evidence na. Nandiyan na yung evidence. Hindi na tayo magpapakahirap. Okay? So, okay. Good naman yung kanyang back. So, check natin. I sees. Capacitors. Kung may failure, especially on resistor so let's check that all if I find a problem let's wait for a while okay so uh, it's missing parts ba okay perfect naman medyo madami lang siya okay ating lines data lines okay mukha namang walang corrosion ng ating capacitors so perfect naman siya Okay. Okay. So, clean up lang natin siya. Kasi may pagpagan natin yung gabok. May subukan natin siya ang e-testing. Para malaman natin kung may problem. Okay. So, paint brush lang muna natin yung gabok. Baka magkaroon pa ng cause. Effects. Resistance. So, para maabid natin yung damage. Okay. Okay, let's check what is the problem. So, we need to use my multimeter. So, dito natin sa area na to kasi dito ay kita. Hindi masyada malakas yung lights. Okay. So, diode mode ako kasi medyo sanay ako sa diode mode. So, kisa sa resistance. So, first, we need to check the 12 volts power rail. First pin to 3 pin. Yan, 12 volts yan. Then, yung ating 3.3 volts. Yan. So, good naman siya. Yeah, check din natin. This is a 1.8 volt. So, so far, it's good. Not shorted. Oh, 1 volt. So, not shorted. And this is a VRAM. Okay, 137 millivolts. It's not shorted. Of course, wala naman tayong shorted dito sa mga MOSFET na to. Kasi, um, pag may shorted kasi yan, umatik shorted yung ating 12 volts power rail. So, I think, not shorted naman. So, check natin ito kasi, Ayan, sinecheck ito. ito. Malimit kasi ito ay nagsashorted. So, hindi naman siya shorted. So, ibig sabihin, yung 11 volts, lumiban dito. Tapos, may engage siya na 3.3 volts. Okay naman. So, check natin at the back. Ayan. So, this is, uh, I think, 11 to 11 yata ito. I don't know. I think, dito ang... 
Okay, hindi naman shorted. So, check natin to. This is 11 volts din. Kung shorted. Oh, may capacitor dito kasi yung nakatabi. Kasi nagsushort din to eh. Yung ano, uh, napuputol tong linis na ito. So, based on the experience, ginagamit natin. So, check natin yung BIOS. Baka naman may problema ang ating 1.8 volts sa BDD. Okay. Kasi yung BDD, hindi natin test our so 1.8 volts coil natin. So, we need to check the, this, ano, MOSFET, if shorted, 3.3, 3.7, and 5 volts. Okay. Not shorted. Okay. Iban tayo sa kabila. Of course, check natin to para sure. Yeah. So, not shorted naman. Then, 5 volts. Taga open ang mga gates. So, not shorted. Okay. So, we need to check the B, uh, B core, mga B core supply. Okay. Ang ating... Diode mode is around 7. So, meaning, DT is 7 or 8. Uh -huh, 5. Y5. So, this is 4. Okay. D5, not shorted. Okay. May 1 ohms pa siya. Okay. 1 ohms. Okay. Not shorted. Okay. Let's check what is the problem. Okay. Let's plug in. Then, it's power on. So, i-plug natin yung ating data lines. Baka kasi nakalimutan ko ito nung nakaraan. So, we need to plug in. So, check natin kung iinit mo na ang chip before na mag-plug ng display para may iwasan natin yung bunot saksak. Then, voltage. Yan. So, let's power on. So, remove natin ang power ng hard disk para yung OS hindi masira. Okay, let's power on. Okay, chip ba umiinit? Okay, chip is not warm. Okay, check natin. 1.5, no supply. 1 volts, no supply. And 1.8 volts, we have a supply. And this is uh, 11 volts. So, meaning, this is available but on ating secondary power rail na address ay not available. Okay? So, 3.8. So, ito ay 11. Mayroon siya, 5 volts. So, present. So, let's open natin yung back. So, check natin ito. So, this is 5 volts and 3.11 and 3.8. Okay, present. So, engage natin. So, meron siya 1.8 volts. So, papunta ng chip. So, okay yan. Check natin yung uh, dito yung ating enable so ito ba yun? enable natin okay enable so may point to tayo so, pero mababa yung point to pero wala tayong supply sa point to enable so yung enable dapat natin is 3.3 so meaning may problem tayo sa 1 volt rail pero wala naman tayo nakikita ang shorted okay so nagmula yung ating 1 volt is Dito sa IC na maliit na to. Kasi yung nasa baba is 1.8. Kung check natin yung kanyang enable dito sa side na to. So, meron tayong 1.8 enable. Nandi sa IC. Ah, 1.8 yun. Supply. So, dito yata sa kabila yan. So, let's see. Ah, dito sa taas pala. I'm sorry. Sa kabila kasi yun ang pin 1. Okay, yan. Makikipansin nyo. 3.3 volts supply. Dapat enable sa kabila ng 1 volts ay 3.3 supply, okay? So, wala tayong schematic for this GPU. So, we need to find out another options. Okay, let's turn up. Turn up computer. So, let's see what happened in this area. So, find the... So, ito yun. Ito yung ating enable. So, ang problem natin... <coughs> Wala tayong schematic. Okay, may napapansin ako dito. Parang may scratch siya. Scratch, I think. Uh -huh, may scratch siya. Dalawa. Tapos uh, dito. So, hanap tayo ng donor. Ah, hindi ba kita? Sorry. Can I show on microscope? So, sorry. Repeat. I repeat. So, I, I found that there are missing parts over there. So, scratch. Accidentally scratch. Yan. So, 
Kasi dito, 3.3 enable ng ating 1.2 volts. Then sa ating 1 volts, ay wala tayong enable. Okay? 1.8 available siya. Okay? Pero may missing tayo dito. So, tingnan natin kung connected siya dito. So, buzzer sound. Okay, buzzer sound. Okay? Buzzer. Okay, hindi nagbabuzzer. I don't know. Ayan. So, nagbuzzer siya. Check natin yung 3.3 enable kung connected siya dito. Okay, not connected. So, not connected. How about that? So, not connected. Not connected. Uh -huh, not connected. So, I don't know what is connected over here. So, check natin lahat ng pins. So, try. Try and error. Because we don't have a schematic right now. So, we need to find another options. But, I don't find. I don't see any connections between any ball and these missing parts okay so we need to uh, find a actual abstract in uh, any donor board or schematic but but i already have a donor board here so let's find out what is the value oh uh -huh, i see uh, i found out that the missing is one resistor so i don't know what is the value of this resistor so let's find out let's need to test on ah uh, no no oh amd so we have 6.6 .6 ohms on my tester and we need to check what is the value of this resistor okay so i i see the 6.6 .6 kilo ohms meaning 6 6.6 .6 kilo ohm, but no need to uh, to find another resistor so we need to pick that resistor and try to transfer on the missing parts so let's try so let's turn on my so uh, you will set to 350 heating temperature so let's try to pick this resistor Okay. Okay, where's my Atana? Okay, try to apply some flux or some soldering lead to say this is a low melt solder. This is a best option to remove parts. Hello na, kumusta? Ano ma, nabili po ng hapunan? Are you okay? Okay, gising na yung aking baby. Okay, so we need to remove that. Okay, I already picked that piece of resistor. So we need to transfer over there. Over here. Okay, let's apply some plugs. Okay, let's pick the resistor and try to resolder it. Okay, just slowly because this it's too small compared to other parts. So this is it's too small. Okay, so, so we need to solder. Okay. Ah. Okay, it's connected. So try another one side. Okay, let's try on other side if the resistor is removed. Okay. Uh-huh. Let's wait. Resistor is Okay. Let's try again. It move out or not? Okay, it's perfect. So I think this is no connections. So let's check. Let's try again if working or not. Uh, let's check first what is the value of this resistor.
Pinagawa? Ah, okay. Oh, ba't nag-chat pa siya? Ah, technician. Ay, yung mga baguhan lang yan. Nagkano lang ng... Para nangyari. Anong nangyari, guys? So, may customer tayo nag-chat sa ating page. So, nagano lang siya ng price. Kasi baguhan siya. Doon nag-try repair. So, balay-balay customer. So, customer daw natin. Nagpapagawa sa akin. Tapos, nagtanong lang ng presyo. Tapos, ngayon, nakakuha siya ng price sa ganong modelo. Sa ganong specs. Then, ginawa niya. Then, nagkaroon siya ng pera. So, ayos. Ganon talaga. So, yun na. Uh, Ayan. Okay. No problem. Okay. So, let's check. Ah, lagyan mo siya ng tag na technician. Kasi ano yan eh, magtatanong uli yan sa akin. Meron diyang tag tayo na technician para pag nagtanong ulit kasi minsan kailangan nating bawasan yung customers na hindi naman nagpapagawa. Lagyan mo ng tag. Nalagyan ko siya ng tag eh kasi minsan nagtatanong lang sila eh. Priority natin yung customers. Ayan, so, rinig nyo ang lahat ng ating pinag-usapan. So, ganun talaga. This is my services. So, nalagyan ko siya ng tag as uh, technician para kasi masyadong marami yung nag-chat sa atin ng customers. So, we need to uh, ano, need natin mag priority. So, let's check what is the value of this resistor. Okay, 3.3. So, let's check on the other side. So, 3.3. Oh, chip is heating. Okay, let's wait. So, I think the problem is on resistor. Okay, good job. Very good. Natuto siya sa ating mga video. So, ayan, ganyan talaga. Uh, minsan, uh, tayo ay nakakatulong ng libre. <laughs> ayan. <laughs> Pero, hindi pa naman kasi doon natatapos. So, hindi naman niya makukuha lahat ng experience natin. May difference pa rin. Mara yung nakatulong tayo sa kanya, at least, magiging siyang balang araw, magiging siyang magaling na technician. Kailangan lang niya mag-aaral. Yeah. Aral lang ng aral sa, sa mga baguhang technician. Kasi marami nag-ano eh, nag-ano sa akin, nag-chat ng mga nagpagtatanong. So, lagi ko lang pinapayo sa kanila is, ano, sabi ko, ano lang, kapag hindi kayo nireplyan, huwag kayo magagalit. Laging ganyan. Kasi, Marami sa akin nagtatanong, ganyan eh. Uh, hindi ko lang na-replyan. Tatanong. Mga nag-aaral maging technician. So, galit na. Ang dami nang sinabi. Dapat hindi ganon. Tekni, ano kayo, nag-aaral kayo. Estudyante ka pa lang eh. Gagalit ka sa teacher mo eh. Parang ganon kasi yan eh, sa school. Parang nilalampasan mo agad yung teacher mo. Eh. Hindi mo pa naman kaya yung mga bagay na ganon. Ayan. Okay, napansin ko dito sa nire-repair natin. Continuation lang tayo. So, uminit siya. Nag, uh, napansin ko, kasi sa ilalim, na-touch ko siya. Nag, siguro, may supply na itong ating voltage dito na 1 volt. So, problem, naging problem natin. Tapos, yun lang. Okay, let's try natin. Kung nagkaroon siya ng, ano eh, uh, voltages. So, we need to check it. Ay, dala ni mami, anak, dala. Just wait. Wait mo lang si Mami Pauwi na yun. So, power on. So, minute siya, guys. So, check natin yung 1 volts para makita nyo. Yan, mayroon tayong 1 volts. Okay, may init siya. Okay, may display. So, check natin. Bench. Okay, we have a display. Okay? So, success yung update. Update sa ating nire-repair. So, ayan. Ito na yung ating nire-repair. So, okay na siya. It's working fine. Show ko sa inyo ang ating ayan, stress test. So, it's working fine. Yeah. So, stress test on 24 minutes. So, temperature natin is, is lower lang. Pag palit na na ng thermal phase, this is uh, 69 degrees Celsius. So, hanggang 83 degrees Celsius yun yung pinaka-lower temperature. Pero ito ay 69 lang. It's napaka-baba. Kayang-kaya na pang matagalan. So, okay. So, 2GB lang yung ating nire-repair na DDR5, Hynix din ang memory. So, 2GB, Gigabyte. 
128-bit. Ayan. So, okay na siya guys. It's working fine. So, session back na natin sa ating customer. Okay? So, muli. Hanggang dito na lang muli ang ating video repairing. So, muli. Nagpapasalamat ako sa inyong pagsubaybay at panonood sa aking video vlog. Okay? So, see you on the next video. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. Okay? Bye! See you on the next video.